guys. This is part two of a propane conversion from Grenergy. I've just demonstrated here. This heater is a 1500 watt heater. This mini heater here is a 250 to 300 watt heater. And this is a EU2000 surge. On this is 2000 watts with the continuous power of 1600 watt. This is a 1500 watt heater. It ran fine with it, plus an additional uh, 250 to 300 watts, all plugged into one receptacle, and ran, it runs fine. And I've just pointed out that the overload alarm did not trip when running two heaters at once. So, What's the main difference between our kit and another brand's kit? Well, this is the other brand, and here's ours. Very similar fittings and whatnot. Great quality fittings. Good quality demand regular. But we have this adjustment here, whereas they do not have any at all. And this adjustment here is used for high idle for when it's off eco throttle. And adjustments right from behind here is good for uh, low idle situations, but it doesn't do quite well with high idle. So this is where you have to adjust it from here. And this is very important to have. Second thing would be the fuel adapter. Here's a uh, set brand. At first, I wasn't quite sure what this was made out of, but then it dawned upon me this is a 3D printed plastic, well, unknown plastic. I figured, you know, if you want a good quality kit, you have great fittings, brass, good quality fittings, regulators, good quality hose until you come to this and it's just plastic. You can't have that. So I have this made machine from a solid piece of T6061 aluminum and how that all fits well it fits great if you look here it just sandwiches between the carburetor and the air box and it comes with hardware with everything to be bolted on perfectly fine the cover bolts over just perfectly fine And so this was three or four months in development. So why was this very, very important? Well, we'll explain that in part three of the video. But also, this is one of the reasons why this generator runs very smooth. And with our competitor, because we wanted to be able to run this kit on all EU 2000s and 2200 generators. And what I've noticed is that this EU-2000 and this EU-2000 is slightly different. So I call this Series 1. That over there is Series 2. This is made from 20, 2001 to 2011. And that is from 2012 to 2017. So this is a very early model this is probably a uh, 2002 e2000 and that there is a the newer one these if you notice if you if i come back around here honda 2000 incompatible models this is from our this is the other brand and this is their product manual and they state on the 2000s older than the year 2011 with serial number range below EAJ 2017 305 should not be covered to propane. Anything higher would be okay. Well, I've converted it and it runs fine. Thanks to this and this as well. If there's any questions or concerns, please let me know. There will be a video part three getting more into depth on this particular part. Thanks.